Scott, opening day MBAA 2023 here out on the central uh, exhibit floor. I understand since we last talked at Oshkosh, you've got some developments in your fuel program. Tell me about it. Um, so one of the things that we've been working on since 2016 was a new design and in, in incorporating things that are really were, you know, uh, what you would expect here at NBAA, um, it, which is a fuel sender that has pitch compensation and a fuel sender that has uh, the ability for dynamic damping. And, you know, it's just bringing that next level of capability into what we're doing. But that, you know, required now an extensive amount of software, software development, as well as a brand new TSO program. The new unit's got pitch compensation, it's got dynamic damping, it's got a more advanced communication level, so we can handle things in CAN bus or RS-232, RS-485. And there's some interesting applications we can start looking at. We could you know, provide a range ring to a Garmin uh, GPS, you know, that's actual fuel quantity remaining in the tank. We have enough damping to be able, you know, to do something on that order. And it was a step for us to move into this programmable logic, basically, that we were using before because of the longevity of those components to something that's software-based. We had to do that, you know, for the throttle that's shown here. We've got some other flight control interfaces that we're presently working on, but basically using all the same technology that we developed, you know, from basically from day one, now just applying a smarter brain to it, really. Now, what markets will this technology be deployed on first? We're here, you know, at MBAA, working with some partners here Raisebeck and Mid-Continent on an STC for the King Air series. We're going to bring a much more capable fuel quantity system to the King Air series. Where does it go from there? I don't know. Um, I don't know if I can announce it. Um, we, we're working with a large uh, company <laughs> based in Wichita uh, on their, their aircraft. And we made indications that you know maybe we can start looking at uh, you know the, the the smaller series of jets that are out there you know where where your wing you know wing uh, cord is maybe you know from eight to ten inches, um, which we've been able to handle pretty well. You know not not jumping up to Gulfstream levels, but I think we can do a, a really good job on the on the smaller business jets. We appreciate your time on opening day, MBAA 2023. We look forward to catching up with you. A uh, couple more months, God only knows what you'll have done by then. Oh, <laughs> if I could only show you what we're doing. It's, uh, it's, pretty, it's some pretty phenomenal things happening around the shop.